find a word safari. It was not here before. So new words can come, but they add on to what you have. Not to replace what you have and make you forget your own. Cultural literacy is a great instrument in transmitting knowledge from generation to generation, as well as upholding cultural values and norms. Concern now is the infiltration of unwholesome behaviors and practices. According to some scholars, it's also an important feature that aids in the improvement of academic performance, especially in lower primary, since it provides faster and quality learning. Those who study in, in their local languages, they, they understand. They perceive and understand things faster quicker. and better, yeah. quicker, than those who study in a language which is foreign to At them. The the and, if you want to dis, and if you want to destroy a people, you first de destroy their language, their culture, and ways of life. The book titled Saga City of Rinyankore Rukiga Proverbs, authored by late Reverend Laban Tibeching, unfolds and appreciates the values of upholding diversity in literacy culture. And some of these proverbs are as rich as those that you'll find in the Bible. So I think the, the message to all of us, what can we preserve for the future generations to come and find, and how do we preserve our culture? That's very important. There are so many foreign cultures that are infiltrating us, but this is... Our roots is culture. The book also transcribes constructive proverbs, prevent hold power of information, morals, and education. The chairman, Education Review Commission, Amanya Mshaga, underscores the need for implementation of learning in the mother tongue, especially in lower primary. You don't do things because they are convenient to you. You do things because they were in a place, they are the ones running, and you don't change things before you even apply them. What is in place already be implemented. That is all, really. It is not complicated. It is like Swahili. Swahili. We have been preparing for Swahili for going to 20 years. Teaching and speaking of the mother tongue accordingly is believed to water down the indoctrination of the young generation with imported and unworthy cultures and norms. We would like to, to encourage, encourage sanity, and care and love, but at the same time, that that which is clear, even from the word go, according to the order of creation. It also helps them appreciate their sense of.